are either of you actually going to make a move? Oh, Esme, dear Esme, chess isn't about making moves. I'm pretty sure it is. Olivia's right. It's about the space between the moves. I once saw Mr Snuggles playing chess. He didn't make a single move the entire game. One within 15 minutes. It's all about focus. If you really focus on each piece, become one with the chessboard. Breathe in the aroma of... Slime? Ugh, Olivia, I told you I didn't want to play slime chess. That wasn't me. Guys, it's not about the slime. It's about the space between the slime. <laughs> Oh, ha, ha, Esme. Where did this slime come from? Uh, I think I have an idea. Malice, of course it was you. Huh? You pelted us with slime. Me? I wish. I've been trying to perfect my slime cannon for weeks. Can't get it to work. Hmm. Oh! See? Oh. Are you playing chess? A word of advice. Don't play against Mr Snuggles. That bear really knows his way around a chessboard. Or rather the space is... Oh, enough about chess already. We've got to find out where this slime is coming from. Hmm, where's Liliana? You're right. I haven't seen her all day. Boo. Whoa, whoa, whoa. The name's Liliana. Princess Liliana. Liliana, you completely ruined our game of chess. Oh, chess is boring. Thank you. I've got a much better game. As long as it doesn't involve a slime gun. It doesn't. It involves four slime guns. The rules of the game are simple. Get hit and you're out. Last princess standing wins. Awesome! That does actually sound pretty fun. I just have one question. I don't want to play. Three, two, one... Go! Uh, let's just get this over with. Right, if you want to catch a princess, you have to think like a princess. Even I am a princess, I just have to think like myself. On second thoughts, maybe that wasn't the best idea. Uh-oh. Hee <laughs> one down. Ah. Uh. Tastes quite nice, actually. I bet Liliana thinks she's got this in the bag. Well, I'll show her. Speak of the devil. Reach for the sky, Liliana. Very good, Liliana. Very good. Fool me once, shame on me. But fool me twice, aha! Last. Very good again, Liliana. Fool me twice, shame on me. Aha, again. Okay, no more. I'm not falling for it again. Wise choice, Olivia. Thanks, cutouts. Wait. Rats. Ew. Stupid. Muddy. Forest. Right. Time for a sit down, I think. Hmm. Aha! This should do the trick. Ha ha ha! This is far too easy. Just Isabella to catch now. <clears throat> I think you're forgetting someone. Malice, you're playing now, are you? I sure am. And guess what I just finished? Whoa! Prepare, dear Liliana, to feel the wrath of... My Slime Cannon Ultra Mega Super Great Awesome Mega Ultra 3000! Ha! <sighs> Good name. Oh, quiet! Huh? Ha <laughs> ha! Better luck next time, Malice. <laughs> <laughs> Time to finish this game off once and for... Oh, I guess that makes me the winner. Anyone for a game of chess? Eaten by 
by the demon surprise again? Ugh! Mr. Snuggles, who put this here? This isn't funny anymore, whoever keeps doing this. Tell me again why we're going for a nighttime walk in the woods. Because it's fun? It's not, it's scary. Ah! See? Oh, it's just Mr. Snuggles, Olivia. Well, I'm sorry, but even teddy bears falling from the sky is scary. Where did he come from? Malice. Looks like she's just gone to sleep. Come on. What do you mean, come on? Malice is asleep. Have you ever been in her tower? No, and I've never planned to. Oh, well, I'm not going. I'm just going to stay here, alone. In the woods. The scary, dark woods. Esme, wait up! Oh, Esme, what have you done? This place is a tip. It was already like this, and shh! What a mess! This place is disgusting! This is weird! Our school yearbook! Our class as well! Hmm, I remember that girl. Alice! Alice something! Why would Malice have circled Alice in our yearbook? I don't know, unless... <gasps> Malice is Alice! Hey, when did we learn to communicate telepathically? We didn't. So we're just talking out loud in silly voices. Oh, let's hope we didn't wait. Malice? We should run. Quickly, before she knows our plan! You do realise you guys are speaking out loud, right? We did it again! Run! So you're saying Malice used to be our classmate Alice and then she turned evil? Yes! But what turned her evil? Maybe it was something we did. Can I have a go? I don't know, Alice. It's Mr Snuggles' turn next. Two seconds, Esme. I'm coming up. Oh, I wouldn't. This branch might not take the weight of the three of us. The three of us? Yeah. Me and Mr Snuggles are already up here. You princesses. So that means we can talk to each other whenever we want. Mr Snuggles, Mr Snuggles, do you copy? Repeat, this is Olivia to Snuggles. OK. Maybe I wasn't that kind either. It's all our fault. We didn't share our things with Alice, and that turned her evil. She became malice because of us. Oh no, what are we going to do? Princesses, it's simple. We'll go round there and apologise. didn't turn evil because we didn't share our things with her. She turned evil because we didn't share Mr Snuggles with her. <laughs> you think I turned evil because of you, princesses, and some stupid teddy bear? Exactly. Ha! I turned evil because my whole family was evil. It's in my blood. But you were cuddling Mr Snuggles. An experiment to see what it felt like. Oh, and it felt Awful. Anyway, you princesses are trespassing on evil property. Do I need to use my teddy cannon again? Mm, yeah, yeah I, I think it's time. Uh, uh, Lots to do. I'm sorry, Mr. Snuggles. Let's keep this between us, yeah? They 
I should be here any second. Now. Olivia! Huh? Oh, Esme, you're late. Sorry. I was just adding the finishing touches to our midnight feast. You mean you were eating our midnight feast? A good chef always tastes what they cook, Olivia. <sighs> well, where are the others? Ah! Whew. Sorry I'm late, Olivia. My jetpack broke down and I had to wait for Cloudside assistance. You know how it is. Since when did you have a jetpack? Oh, I just whipped it up this morning! Still needs a bit of work. Well, at least you're here now. That just leaves Isabella. She's not very good at travelling by herself. I hope she's all right. Huh? 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 Come on, Isabella. You can do this. Three, two, one. Oh, for you. Ahem. What? These are brand new shoes. Right, now we're all here, the sleepover can finally commence. Yay! All right. Item number one on the agenda, pillow fight. OK, but first, let's lay down the ground rules. No? Uh. Game on, princesses. This palace ain't big enough for the four of us. Right. Item number two. Midnight feast. Wow, you really didn't eat all the midnight feast, Esme. Oh, no. This pal was at least twice the size before I had my... snack. Well, I can't wait to dig in. <laughs> Still hungry, I guess. <gasps> right. Item number three. Ghost story. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> uh hum. <laughs> Sorry. Right, Isabella. You go first. Me? Um, okay, um. This is the story of the, um... Muffin. Muffin? Muffin. A uh, monster. Yes, that's right, the Muffin Monster. Once upon a time there was a Muffin Monster and it ate everyone. The end. Well, that wasn't very good. <sighs> Let's just go to bed. Muffin Monster, eh? Hmm, this gives me an idea! talking about that dog riding a hot air balloon. But yeah, Malice didn't seem herself. Normally, she'd at least manage an insult. Prince Sissy, 
goody no shoes. Esme, what are you looking at? Sorry, just remembering Malice's insults. Hey guys, what's up with Malice? Hey Liliana, we were just wondering the same thing. Yeah, I thought she was going to knock my ice cream out my hand, but it's still here. She's being so unmalicey. Normally, she'd never miss an opportunity to prank us, but recently, it's like she doesn't care. I noticed that too. Seriously, guys, what are you looking at? Nothing. It just helps when you're remembering things. Scientifically proven. Try it. There's definitely something wrong with Malice. Amazing! Maybe I'll finally be able to do, well, anything without her ruining it. We can't just ignore it if something's wrong with her. Yeah, I suppose you're right. Someone should go speak to her to find out what's wrong. Great idea. Not me, though. Yeah, me neither. Well, I'm definitely not doing it. So, what's wrong then, Malice? Right, now what's wrong is that you're in my tower. Come on, Malice, what's up? You're not being yourself. I know. I've retired. Retired? Why? Because I suck at being evil, Esme. That's why. <laughs> <sighs> Malice, you're not bad at being evil. You're brilliant at it. I'm not. You are. Look at all the evil stuff in this room. See? A witch's broomstick. Only a truly evil witch could fly one of these bad boys. I use that to sweep up. Hmm. Aha! A cauldron. There's even something terrible brewing in there now. What's this then? A potion to give whomever drinks it feathers or dooms them to eternally smell like a foot. That's my dinner. Ah, then I take it back. You are bad at being evil. See, now get out. I'm going to do whatever it is people do once they've retired. Knit or play golf or do some gardening. Gardening, eh? I hear the palace is looking for a new gardener. I'll put in a good word for you. OK, so Malice should be here any moment. We all know the plan, right? Yes, she thinks she's coming round to do some gardening. Then we're going to loudly laugh about how bad she's at being evil. But you never told us what happens next. Yeah, Esme. No time for that. Here she comes. Just follow my lead. <laughs> yeah, Malice is so bad at being evil. Would you believe she's got a broomstick, but she can't ride it? Ha! What kind of witch can't ride a broomstick? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and I heard she still sleeps with a teddy. <laughs> I suck at being evil, eh? Well, how's this for evil? Malice is back, princesses! Well, at least she's feeling herself again. She's got better at magic as well. <laughs> Actually, her spell missed. But the fountain. That was me. I put my foot on the hose so it explode with a giant rush of chocolate when I let go. So what happened to Malice's spell then? I have no idea. Filled with, oh, you'll never guess what they were filled with. Chocolate. We ate chocolate. Oh, those princesses are just so happy with themselves. Well, I have a plan to make sure this so-called picnic is a complete washout. <laughs> and at another point, I actually did turn it into a chocolate egg. Oh, <laughs> it was so funny. Now, let's see what you can do. Yes, come on. Oh, wow. 
Well, that's not right. Hmm, I wonder if... Huh? Hmm. Oh dear. Right, let's try that again. That should do it. <laughs> Which is why I am absolutely certain that the correct number of dinners is actually two, maybe even three. It just makes perfect sense in every way. You have one dinner to warm up with, a second dinner for mates, and then a third dinner for dessert. Hang on, is it me or did it just get a little chilly? Right, time to fix this useless machine once and for all. <sighs> this is the life. You said it, Olivia. Who would have thought you could sunbathe in the middle of a storm, eh, Malice? Princesses. Cheers! Cheers.